What's up guys? Today we have the Bombshell E-Line, which consists of five different flavors. Shout out to Vape Craft for sending this uh, line to me for review. Uh, so let's go ahead and get into it. We got a lot to do. As you can see, they go on with that uh, theme from the iconic ladies from TV, the, you know, motion picture and all that stuff. And it's a pretty cool theme they got going on with that. So we got five of them to go over. Uh, so this is how we gonna do it. I'm gonna start my least favorite and move all the way up to the, uh, my top favorite. I'm gonna keep the same setup, but I'm gonna change the cotton as we go. So let's get into it. First up is Elizabeth. And the flavor profile for this one is the cream cheese frosted cinnamon tree. They come in 60 ml chubby gorilla bottles. I think they're running at $22.99. Um, I'll throw a link to Vape Craft if you want to go check that out. I'm not too familiar with their site, but I think they have coupon codes every now and then on there, so you might be able to get it a little cheaper than that. But don't quote me on that. So we're looking for a cream cheese cinnamon tree. I'm gonna start this vape out at 85 watts. I'm running a uh, Asmodus Lustro with uh, Akita's RDA on top. I'm gonna leave it wide open. 85 watts. First off, I'm getting that cinnamon and then followed by like a, it's like a cream cheese. Let's go ahead and shut it down halfway. Leave it at 85 watts. Real light on the cinnamon, which I like. Uh, let's bump it up to 125. At 125, it really brought that cream cheese flavoring up in it, and it toned that uh, that real faint cinnamon down a lot more. It's a real different blend. Uh, I'm not used to a vaping a uh, cream cheese blend. It's not bad though. Uh, just a real different blend. Now, let's move to the next one. Next up, we have Lucille, aka I love Lucy. Okay, the flavor profile for this one is uh, is a pineapple and uh, creamy coconut, and like a sweet pineapple off the uh, smell test. A little hint of coconut in it. We gonna run this one on the Bonza RDA. Now my ex Prio smoke mod, 85 watts wide open. Getting a nice uh, pineapple, uh, real faint, uh, slight hint of coconut cream to it. Let's bump it up to 125 and check the air flow down halfway. 125, halfway. It brought that pineapple so it's kind of slightly sweet pineapple uh, not really getting much of that that coconut cream so mostly you're gonna get like a slightly semi-sweet uh, pineapple flavor into it uh, pretty decent flavor let's move on to the next okay so moving on next up we have Maryland the flavor profile for this one is a strawberry marshmallow fluff so went ahead and changed the cotton out fresh cotton so we're looking for a strawberry marshmallow fluff. 85, wide open. Right off the bat, I'm getting that marshmallow strawberry uh, flavor to it. Uh, the, the strawberry is sort of like a fresh strawberry. It's not that candy strawberry. Oh, let's get a cookie. It's a semi-ripe uh, strawberry, uh, not too sweet e-liquid, but let's bump it up to 125. Shut it down halfway. At 125, it brought more of that marshmallow-y uh, texture up to it, followed by that semi-ripe uh, strawberry. Decent flavor. What I found out with these first three I was reviewing, the flavor was real light on them. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, get into the last two. Next up is Audrey. Flavor profile for this one is a lemon bar with a powdered sugar. Fresh cut. What I'm getting off this one is a lemon bar. Uh, you can even taste that uh, powdered sugar. The flavoring off of this one, uh, it's got a little more punch to what I like it at. Uh, that's why it's the last two. 
not that infamous uh, pledge flavor. It's a nice lemon flavor. Uh, liking that uh, powdered sugar on it. How you go up, the more you pour that powdered sugar taste to it. Let's get one more vape and we're gonna move on to the uh, top. Okay, last but not least, definitely in this case, uh, we have Sophia. And the flavor profile for this one is a raspberry lemonade Italian ice. So you're gonna get a little menthol hit on this one. Out of the whole lineup, uh, I think this one came in number one for me. It's just a, a nice, cool, refreshing uh, Italian ice. See, we got a fog down in here. Okay, let's get one. Right off the rip, I'm getting that raspberry lemonade, uh, you know, followed by the menthol. Menthol hit not too strong. I think it's just the right amount of menthol at 85 watts. Uh, but yeah, real nice and refreshing. Any liquid uh, flavors there. Like I was saying, the other flavors, they just seem like they were slightly uh, lacking that flavor punch. Real nice flavor running wide open. Uh, I think this one is the best one out the whole line. A uh, nice refreshing e liquid right here. You get that nice cool uh, lemonade and it's followed by that raspberry and uh, menthol. Uh, overall, this is real good. And I'll throw a link in the description to uh, Vapecraft. Uh, I think all these 60 mils was running at $22.95, sort of like that. Y'all know me, uh, 22 something. That's pushing it uh, for 60 mils. Like I was saying, I think they have coupon codes over there sometimes. Uh, I'm not really sure about that, but uh, you can check it out and see if they got it. some kind of sale going on. In my opinion, for this uh, bombshell line, I think they can bring that price down just a little bit more and uh, you'll be a-okay. And you already know, I appreciate y'all coming through for the review. As always, hit that like, subscribe, share if you will. Until the next time, make your day obey.